Pierce Brosnan is an Irish actor and film producer. He was the fifth actor to play the fictional secret agent James Bond in the Bond film series, starring in four films from 1995 to 2002 and in multiple video games. Born, May 16, 1953, age 70 years, Drogheda, Ireland. Spouse, Keely Shea Smith, M., 2001, Cassandra Harris, M., 1980 to 1991. Children, Charlotte Brosnan, Paris Brosnan, Dylan Brosnan, Sean Brosnan, Christopher Brosnan. Grandchildren, Isabella Sophie Smith, Lucas Smith. Parents, Mary Mae Smith, Thomas Brosnan. Alma Mater, Drama Center London. Pierce Brosnan net worth $200 million. Pierce Brosnan. Early life. To contact please check my YouTube video description and visit my website. Alma Mater, Drama Center London. Pierce Brosnan net worth $200 million. Pierce Brosnan. Early life. Brosnan was born on May 16, 1953 in Drogheda, County Louth, the only child of May Nay Smith and Thomas Brosnan, a carpenter. He has the same name as his grandfather, Pierce Brosnan, whose first name was in honor of his mother Margaret Pierce. Better source needed for 12 years, he lived in Navan, County Meath, and said in 1999 that he considers it to be his hometown. His father abandoned the family when Brosnan was an infant. When he was four years old, his mother moved to London to work as a nurse. From then on, he was largely brought up by his maternal grandparents, Philip and Kathleen Smith. After their deaths, he lived with an aunt and then an uncle, but was subsequently sent to live in a boarding house run by a woman named Eileen. He later said a childhood was fairly solitary. I never knew my father. He left when I was an infant. To be Irish Catholic in the 1950s and have a marriage which was not there, a father who was not there, the mother, the wife suffered greatly. My mother was very courageous. She took the bold steps to go away and be a nurse in England. Basically wanting a better life for her and myself. My mother came home once a year, twice a year. Brosnan was brought up in a Catholic family and educated in a local school run by the De La Salle brothers while serving as an altar boy. He left Ireland on August 12, 1964 and went to Scotland to be reunited with his mother and her new husband, William Carmichael, at their home in Long Nidri. Carmichael took Brosnan to see a James Bond film for the first time, Goldfinger, at the age of 11. They later moved back to London, where Brosnan was educated at Elliot School in Putney, now known as Ark Putney Academy. When discussing his transition from Ireland to England, he said, When you go to a very large city, a metropolis like London, as an Irish boy of ten, life suddenly moves pretty fast. And you're Irish. And they make you feel it, the British have a wonderful way of doing that, and I had a certain deep sense of being an outsider. His nickname at school was simply Irish. After leaving school at 16, Brosnan decided to be a painter and began training in commercial illustration at St. Martin's School of Art in London. While attending a rehearsal for a workshop at the Oval House, he saw a fire eater teaching people how to eat fire and decided to join in. He trained for three years as an actor at the Drama Centre London. 20. Describing the feeling of becoming an actor and the influence it had on his life, he said, When I found acting, or when acting found me, it was a liberation. It was a stepping stone into another life, away from a life that I had, and acting was something I was good at, something which was appreciated. That was a great satisfaction in my life. Personal life. Brosnan has married twice, having been widowed once, and has five children and four grandchildren. He met Australian actress Cassandra Harris through her stepson David Harris, the nephew of Richard Harris, shortly after leaving drama school. On meeting her, he said, what a beautiful looking woman. I never for an instant thought she was someone I'd spend 17 years of my life with. I didn't think of wooing her or attempting to woo her, I just wanted to enjoy her beauty and who she was. They began dating and bought a house in Wimbledon. They married in December 1980 and had one son together, Sean, who was born on September 13, 1983 and later became an actor. They also raised Harris's two children from her prior marriage, Charlotte, 1971-2013, and Chris. Brosnan adopted them after their father Dermot Harris died in 1986, they subsequently took his surname. Early in their relationship, Brosnan worked in West End plays and television films. After Harris appeared in the James Bond film For Your Eyes Only in 1981, they secured a bank loan and moved to Southern California, where Brosnan was cast in the title role of the TV series Remington Steel, easing their financial worries. Career 
Graduating from the Drama Center in 1975, Brosnan began working as an acting assistant stage manager at the York Theatre Royal, making his acting debut in Wait Until Dark. Within six months, he was selected by the playwright Tennessee Williams to play the role of McCabe in the British premiere of the Red Devil Battery Sign, billed as Pierce Brosnan. His performance caused a stir in London and Brosnan still has the telegram sent by Williams, stating only, Thank God for you, my dear Boyg. In 1977, he was picked by Franco Zeffirelli to appear in the play Philomena by Eduardo de Filippo opposite Joan Plowright and Frank Finley. Brosnan continued his career making brief appearances in films such as The Long Good Friday, 1980, and The Mirror Cracked, 1980, as well as early television performances in The Professionals, Murphy's Stroke, and Play for Today. He became a television star in the United States with his leading role in the popular miniseries Manions of America. He followed this in 1982 with the BBC's nine-part miniseries Nancy Astor, which aired in America on Masterpiece Theatre, that dramatized the life of Lady Astor, the first woman to sit in the British Parliament. His portrayal of Robert Gould Shaw II garnered him a 1985 Golden Globe Award nomination for Best Supporting Actor. In 1982, Brosnan moved to Southern California and rose in popularity in the United States playing the title role in the NBC romantic, often comedic detective series Remington Steele. The Washington Post noted that same year that Brosnan could make it as a young James Bond. After Remington Steele ended in 1987, Brosnan went on to appear in, among other projects, The Fourth Protocol, 1987, a Cold War thriller in which he starred alongside Michael Caine, The Deceivers, the miniseries James Clavell's Noble House, both 1988, and The Lawnmower Man, 1992. In 1992, he shot a pilot for NBC called Running Wild, playing a reporter for Auto World magazine with Jennifer Love Hewitt playing his daughter, which never aired. In 1993 he played a supporting role in the comedy film Mrs. Doubtfire. He appeared in several television films, including Victim of Love, 1991, Death Train, 1993, and Night Watch, 1995, a spy thriller set in Hong Kong. In 2003, Brosnan was awarded the Irish Film and Television Academy Lifetime Achievement Award for his contribution to Irish film, citation n.